I'm 51 years old, but in my mind, I felt like I was 21, so I was working out like I was 21 years old, and my body started hurting more and more, and it got to the point where the doctor says, your hips are shot, they're bone on bone, you need to get your hips replaced, both of them. And if I didn't have it done soon, I wouldn't be able to walk anymore, so. I did research for approximately one year, calling different hospitals, universities throughout the United States, seeing approximately 10 different doctors to get their opinion. And when I saw Dr. Gordon, I knew that he was the doctor that I wanted to have. So by the time he came to see me, he was pretty clear on what he wanted and how he wanted it done. And uh, I definitely agreed with him once I saw him and how he walked and what his x-rays looked like. There was different ways of having the hip surgery done, uh, posterior, a lateral from the side, and direct anterior approach from the front. Direct anterior approach is a no-brainer to me. The anterior approach is really built as a way where we can get to the hip joint without having to cut through any muscle, and we have a true plane between muscles where we can get to the hip joint safely and effectively. Patients seem to recover at a rate about twice as fast as they did with the posterior approach. After the surgery, everything just clicked. I rehabbed very fast, and after two and a half weeks, I was ready to go back to work already. All right, it's looking pretty good. How's it feeling? I'm rocking. It feels great. When he came in here three weeks post-op and he was walking in, I couldn't believe it myself. Today, he's about three months out from surgery and uh, I expect right. him to be well on his way to living a normal life and hopefully be able to forget about his hips altogether. He's a phenomenal doctor. I can't even tell you how uh, grateful I am and, and how blessed I am to do my research and find the right doctor. You're all set. Awesome. I feel fantastic. Thanks, awesome. I feel like a million dollars. Thanks, Dave.